If your FlowLogic system automatically shuts off the water, you may easily identify a leak's location or where water was flowing for an abnormal duration. But sometimes the source of abnormal flow isn't obvious. This video can help you figure out the cause of an auto shutoff with guidance for users of the local control panel and FlowLogic app. Remember, FlowLogic automatically shuts off the water when a continuous flow event exceeds the home or away flow time parameters. These settings are adjustable. FlowLogic is not capable of false flow readings. If water flow is indicated, there's certain to be at least a small movement of water through your main water supply. When you have an auto shutoff, to silence the alarm, press the Disable or Silence button. When you're ready to turn the water back on, press the Home or Water On button. The most common leaks are non-damaging yet wasteful toilet leaks due to a faulty toilet flapper or fill valve. With the water on, if you see unexplained flow, indicated by the control panel pinwheel graphic illuminating, or an active flow timer countdown on the app, this is the time to diagnose what's flowing. Beware that water meters cannot see low-level flow, while FlowLogic monitors real-time flow as low as a half ounce per minute depending on the flow sensitivity setting. Use the process of elimination to find hidden leaks. Toilets are the most common source of a leak. Start by shutting off all toilets at the angle stop valve located below the toilet. With all toilets turned off, if flow stops, you've found the culprit. You can determine which toilet has the leak as you hear water flow into the tank once its valve is turned back on, and you'll see flow indication on the control panel or app. Other common leak sources include hose bibs left on outside or dripping faucets inside. Potentially damaging leaks that aren't initially obvious can happen throughout a plumbing supply, such as at failing water heaters or pipes and fittings that may be hidden behind walls and beneath a floor. You should also rule out water flow requirements that aren't leaks but could trigger auto shutoffs. Some appliances like humidifiers require an ongoing small trickle of water that requires raising the flow sensitivity setting. Irrigation systems and water softeners with backwash cycles can trigger auto shutoffs only if they are installed downstream of the FlowLogic system without being integrated properly per the installation instructions. If you've discovered a dripping faucet that needs to be ignored, you have an evaporative humidifier that needs to run in the background, or simply need more water use time for your household or business, you can always adjust the flow sensitivity and the home and away mode flow time allowances from the local control panel or through the app. If you continue to have unexplained water flow after thoroughly checking the property, you may have a hidden leak and need a plumber or a leak detection specialist to identify and fix the problem. See the support section of FlowLogic.com and FlowLogic's other user videos for additional user resources.